Welcome to what is the final day of this build. I do a walk around the house here, show everybody what's going on. You can see actually up there in the corner, those are solar panels. This is a green home, so it's very specifically designed for uh, to be environmentally friendly. So those are solar panels up in the corner, properly placed obviously for best activity with the sun. Uh, and we'll do a quick walk around the house here and show you what's going on. Here's what's going to be the driveway. This is just a uh, rock base. We're going to do it in concrete or asphalt. We'll probably do that tomorrow. May or may not do it before the reveal. Uh, as you can see, the yard is full of mud. 16 inches down is basically uh, water. So uh, it's a very, very interesting build site from a landscaping perspective. Um, I am going to actually introduce you to the guy with the helicopter here coming up. Oh no, he's not there. It's just his boys. So I'll walk around. Hey guys, hey. my dual role is the marketing agent on this build. <laughs> no, I got a guy. Hey, wait a second, I'll come and interview you. Hey, I just I just actually finished saying that here's the guys with the helicopter. Yeah. But then it wasn't him, so how do you guys feel about him drive flying around in a helicopter all the time? Uh Come on, you're on camera. This could be on the vid. This could nice. be on the web. You gotta be nice. Me, don't you? That was you. That was me. You're the guy that flies around the helicopter. Well, you know, I mean, it's me and Greg's helicopter, and I, I came in and bugged you the day before yesterday. No kidding. A, a, a chicken got a back massage and a, my back adjusted. And went back. And we wanted to do it again. I wanted to do it again. And you wanted to do it. Now, how come you guys are getting back massages and we're working? I don't know. You're the one with the carpeted dinner. We had really good chicken. Oh, yeah. Hey, that was actually very good yeah. food in there. Now, you got to introduduce yourself. I'm Pete. I'm Greg's partner. Pete Curtis out of Oklahoma. And you're with uh, which, which company? Simmons oh, yeah. There, where are we? there you go. From Simmons Homes out of where? Out of Tulsa, Oklahoma. And how do you feel about coming down and being a part of this build? We absolutely love it. Yeah, yeah, it's been and in the a whole band of a little drama, but that's all good. Yeah. And, well, uh, you got now. You guys work at the church, right? That's right. And so, how we has just, that been? We just finished it this morning and revealed it today. And, and, how, and how did how was that? It was good. It was great. Tough, as you said, though. It was great. It yeah, was, it was. I know this has been tough, but yeah. it's been fun. Yeah, you know what? It's one of those experiences of a lifetime, right? Yeah. And I love meeting all the new, new builders and everything. That's what, I, that's what I like, too, is, is uh, meeting with different builders throughout the country and just getting together and really doing something that really counts. Yeah, 100%. And your name, sir? My name's Rick. Rick. I work at Simmons also. So, so what, what's your role with the helicopter? <laughs> I just have fun in it. It seems all you guys fly around in a helicopter, flying around, getting massages. Yeah. But i got to get a job like that. <laughs> I prefer the jet, though. The, oh, yeah, I know, yeah. A little bit more leg room. Yeah, they got a private jet as well. Yeah, you big builders. Well, hey, we're very happy to be working with, alongside you guys with the Band of Brothers and, you know, to, to do this and make this dream come true, and especially for the church, for the community. Yeah. I mean, it is a wonderful thing. We've enjoyed it. We really have. Yeah, great. Well, thanks, guys. Thank you. You bet. Thank you. See, I mean, you didn't know you were going to be on camera. Okay, so we'll continue around the house. So... This is the back of the house, main level of the house here, and then that's the front of the house over there. We just finished getting the steps and the railing in there. We're working on that, putting the trim on. Upstairs is up there. Now I can show you the I can show you the inside of the house, but I don't like the outside, but I can't show you the inside. I can show you the outside because uh, media gets to see the outside, but the inside is all about the show. So you'll have to wait, keep on updates on our website so you can see what's happening as the show comes on. May uh, May 18th is when the show is ready. Also, your website so you can see what's happening as the show comes along. May uh, May 18th is when the show is ready. Also, you can see here these tanks. These are specially designed. They capture rainwater. If you look here, they capture rainwater and filter it so it can be used throughout the yard. As part of this green build, one of the things that's really important to note is, is that this is a very special tile that we're using for the walkway. You can see right here. It's actually a rock product that apparently will let about six gallons a minute go through it and it filters water. If you took um, if you took dirty water and ran it through this, by the time it goes through this, it actually filters it out um, because these are made of rocks and minerals, natural rocks and minerals. So 
It's a very, very cool Echo product or a green product as well. To go with the rest of the house. Okay, so now I'm here. Who am I with? Uh, Mike from Permapave. Mike from Permapave. So this is your product? Yes, it is. Okay, so tell us a bit about this, Mike. Uh, by the way, I'm Daryl with... Uh, nice to meet you. Heritage Homes here in Fargo, North Dakota. Uh, basically, it's uh, gravel with a two-part polymer, but it's 100% uh, porous. Okay. So we got vertical and lateral movement through oh. the paver itself. Right. And just a quick demonstration. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. Okay, go ahead. It will actually drain... Um, Seven gallons per second. Seven per second? Yes. Look at that. He's pouring it in the top and it's coming up the bottom like that. Look at that. Look at that. And it doesn't change the a rock at all. It's just the way you go no, and it cleans it, it, right? It changes the actual color of the aggregate. We could choose any color aggregate, any size, any thickness of the paver. Eventually, that will be, we would have a truck we could do on site pours. And, uh, you know, so we have a nice seamless look. Right, and that's what we're doing all along in here, yeah? And depending on what you use the pavers for, in this case, it'll basically, the water will drain right through it, basically go back right into the aquifer. Right, right. Um, otherwise, it could be sent off to, like, a holding tank, be used for irrigation, yeah. and other limitless. So how are you, you're involved in this build, are you local? Uh, local, actually, I'm from uh, Long Island. You're from Long Island? Yes. So that's pretty local, you know, on the side <laughs> of the country. Close enough, just a few hours away. Uh, yeah. And and how do you feel about being involved in this build? Uh, it's definitely an experience. Uh, Have you ever done an happy. extreme makeover before? No, this is my first uh, yeah. extreme makeover. Yeah. Stuff. Uh, but it's been a good experience overall. And uh, we're a little late getting the product in. We were hoping to do this yesterday, but overall everything's going in really well, and uh, we're happy with it. Yeah, great. Well, hey, thanks for being here, and we're happy to be a part of it in New Orleans. And it's great to be down in New Orleans, hey, like to help yes, the community. Great. It's great. Uh, the weather's a lot better than New York right now. Yeah, that's right, yeah. 20 degrees up there. Yeah, hey, now you can't complain. It was 20-some below in Fargo when we left, so... Uh -huh. Hey, got me beat. there you go. All right, well, thanks very, very much, nice especially for the demo. You bet. See you later. They know who you are. Hi, everybody. I'm Diane Corman. I'm the senior producer on Extreme Makeover Home Edition. For that house right I'm there? I'm much shorter than Daryl. So yeah, therefore, see? Therefore, <laughs> you know, that whole thing. That's right. Hey, wait yeah. a second. Hi, I'm Mom. Oh. My wonderful builders from Minot over a year ago. And when I called them, I said, you thought Minot was far? How about New Orleans? And they sort of laughed, and I said, no, really, I'm serious. <laughs> we want you on the all-star team to come down to New Orleans and help us build not just a house, but also a church. And they thought about it for about five seconds, and then they said, of course we'll come. Yeah. Just tell me the details, and when, and where, and how, and what can I do, and that's the kind of guys they are. I mean, Daryl and Tyrone are there to help us whenever Extreme needs them. And it's that kind of family and community that makes it happen. And you've worked with a lot of builders over the years, right? I have worked with so many builders over the last five years, about about 110. And I called seven. And Daryl and Tyrone were one of them on the list that I knew I could count on. And so I said, Fargo, New Orleans, not so far to go. Come on. There you go. Well, Join me. Make we, it happen. We were very honored and humbled when we got the opportunity for us to go down to Minot to do the build. So for us to come down to New Orleans, we, we feel very much this band of brothers. It's an opportunity to really bring some awareness to New Orleans that maybe some people have forgotten about. So how do you feel about what we're doing down here? Obviously, you know, you're the producer, you're the one that made this happen. How do you feel about it? You know, I think it is symbolic and appropriate that we're finishing our 50-state tour here in New Orleans because it's taking the entire country to build the house and the church. It's also taking the entire country to put New Orleans back together. Oh, for Daryl. Uh, we really and truly couldn't do it without our band of brothers, without our reunion, without our all-star team. Coming here, not sleeping, living in trailers, making a difference, picking up the shovels, doing things they haven't done in years like paint and drywall and landscape and it's really amazing. You know, it just shows how much these guys care and Daryl and Tyrone are the best. Heritage Homes, thank you so much for coming. You brought an incredible team here and we thank you from the bottom of our hearts. From Extreme Makeover back to Fargo, you're always family to us.